So we got a call for a Dodge Sprinter van. It sounds like they're clear down in the water or at least near the water because they're in mud, not sand. This is out to Sand Hollow. So we're headed out there with the Jeep to see if we can get them out. Is this for this stuff? You the one I talked to about the Sprinter van? Good. Good, good. Okay, well we'll go down there and look it over and Yeah, we're uh, My name's Matt. Hey, dude. Where are you at? We're uh way further down actually. Oh okay. Yeah. Hop in. Bye bye, hop on in. Yeah. You hooked up, and then I'll tell you exactly what I need you to do. All right. But a lot of times, when you start going backwards in, in mud or sand, the steering wheel doesn't react correctly. Right. Especially in reverse. And so people start mindlessly steering the wheel, which makes it a lot more work. So that's really the only the only thing you have to worry about as far as steering is just not let the steering wheel wander around. Just keep it straight. Yeah, basically straight. Give give little steering inputs, but don't expect don't expect a really normal reaction from them. Um, and then you're going to be helping a little bit with your throttle, not too much. Once we pop you out on the ground, um, get you on this hard pack, you're going to be you're going to be able to go faster than I'm going to want to go. So just let off. All right. Let off, and we will just pull you back here about where the Jeep is. I just don't want you running over this rope. These ropes are expensive, and we don't want to wrap them around and break you know brake lines and stuff like that okay so go ahead and get in it start it up Piece of cake. Kept his wheels straight too. He kept his wheels straight. See, you're in the you're in the top uh, one percent. Top one percentile keeping your wheels straight. That's my best. That's a feather in your cap right there. The Rangers were laughing at me earlier today. Yeah. 
Yep, you're the first ones we've ever heard of getting stuck in mud. Yeah, mud doesn't happen too often. This year we've got a lot of water in here, but usually the water level fluctuates quite a bit. Right. When it goes down, people drive out on these mud flats. Oh, man. They, sometimes it takes like an excavator or at least a skid steer on tracks to get them out. Oh, yeah. Come on, See Max, ya. Baby, let's go. Come on, Max. Slow it up. Right well, that wasn't as bad as it could have been. When they say they're in the mud, sometimes they are really down in there, but. Hi, my son called me on the phone and says that he is binge watching this man doing doing what he towing and hauling things. And he says, and they sell hats, mom, and he does not live here in Hurricane. I came over today to get a hat for my son, Jason. Happy birthday, son. <laughs> So we got a call for a Toyota C in a van. Uh, they're stuck in the sand at Sand Hollow, so it sounds like a pretty basic job. side of a medium rare pole.